Did you know you can go fishing on a Disney cruise? It's true, but it's not the kind of fishing you may be thinking about. Disney Cruise Lines have strict rules when it comes to ducking, the time-honored tradition of leaving a free rubber duck on the ship for someone to discover. The rule is you can't, but what they do have is fishing, or more specifically, a fish extender exchange group. Basically, it's a free gift exchange system carried out among the passengers, like geocaching, but without the hassle of hiking and ripping up public property. Here's how it works. First, if you decide you want to participate, you need to make the decision before you get on board the ship, like days out, because you'll need to bring the small gifts with you, as well as a small gift bag. And also, you have to be a part of the prearranged fishing group. You find these fellow fishers through social media groups. Make sure you find people on your ship during the time you will be on it. That's important. When looking for a Facebook group to join, you may be happy to discover there are types of groups. They are organized by themes as well. People who only want magnets. People who only want Christmas ornaments. Family exchange and adult only. The list goes on and on and on. Each of these groups will have a manager you can reach out to and find out from them what you are truly getting into. And you could be a member of more than one group. Most groups are between five to 10 rooms, but remember, in a family group, there could be three or six people per room. That could be a lot more than you signed up for. People usually don't go over $15 for a gift. Remember, every gift you bring must be able to get through customs and is legal to have on board the ship and that you can get it there and whatever you get in return, you can get back home with you. When you get on the ship, you place the gift in the bag and then bring it to the cabin of the people you have made arrangements with and leave it on their fish hook outside their door. When delivering your gifts, it's considered tradition to do it the same time every day. What time does not matter, but whatever time you pick, that's your gifting time. Just remember the last night of the cruise, the last gift should be delivered before dinner because most people pack before then. If you want a fancy fish bag, but are not handy with the needle and thread and like me, are not craft-minded at all, Amazon and SD have your back. I will leave a link in the description with some bags on Amazon. Whatever you like and no matter your price range, you can get it between one of those two places. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. We love making these videos for you and hope to see you in the next one. Until then, happy cruising.